Oh, that place got trashed. Yay. <laughs> that credo is freaking. What is that? You brought this here for me? Credo requests it. She means to your touch. Hold up. Thanks. This blade's the best battle companion a swordsman could wish for. It didn't break, kind of. Oh wait, no, it didn't break at all. That's what the witnesses said. Guy just came from hell. He's gotta hit up a couple tourist sites. Just so lightly in a time of crisis. Must capture him. Trust me, I'll get it done. Please be careful. You still haven't recovered. There's no time, and duty calls. Can't pass on an emergency. I must return to headquarters and report. Sure can't pack a punch. Oh, it's my turn. Sorry, in your smooches. What can I eat? Alright, can I get some new skills? Oh please, can I streak? Oh, you don't 
use red orbs, you use proud souls. That's strange. What do you use? I'm so confused. Is abilities how you know? Okay, what do I use red orbs for? Yeah, so I'm used to So in I'm used to Minecraft 5, that's the first game that I played. Because I just the one I saw on YouTube I thought was cool. Got it. Well it worked a long time, thank god, yeah. So I'm used to his buster being like the devil break, like you use B to fling out and grab something for with the devil breaker and then you use trigger to use the buster when you're um when you're not locking on and then it grapples when you are locking on it's like trigger like i would be grabbing that guy or like i would be grabbing that guy with devil breaker using this button whatever let's just combo these guys Investigating, woo! <laughs> Resident Evil. This is how you can know this game is Resident Evil. Oh, it used to be. See, so they just kind of got rid of stuff like this in Devil May Cry 5. It's like, there's not that many, like, puzzles like this. There's just... Oh. Never mind, it's not a puzzle. Never mind, okay, this is kind of like... Yeah, this is definitely more like Devil May Cry 5. Like, the animations are more like Devil May Cry 5. The lock, yeah, the lock on. Yeah, the use of B doing something other than just shooting. Yeah, like the Red Queen Sword. Oh, I can use Exceed. Oh, Exceed is so much easier than Devil May Cry 5. Oh, Devil May Cry 5 has sit here for like 5 minutes to get one Exceed gauge. Oh, but you lose it like immediately. Oh, you do that in Devil May Cry 5 as well, but... In peak of combat, you don't lose your double trigger immediately. You're not double trigger, you're seed immediately. So it's a little nicer. Ooh. Oh, it's Venom. Oh no, what is this? Oh, the guy just got venomized. I keep hitting trigger. I'm not gonna be having good like videos, like combos in my videos. Oh, the sound is still the same as Devil May Cry 3. And one. The one didn't really have sealed doors, one was just kind of sealed in general. Well, it had sealed doors, but not sealed areas. Oh, wait, no, I go this way. Into the door. E oh, God. This is my kind of party. Can we kind of jump down there? Nope. Okay. Just like the rest of the games. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh darn it! In Devil May Cry 5, you normally could just like, like you, I could literally just take Nero and just kind of jump, jump, air hike, okay, jump, air, uh, jump, air hike, then uh, devil, devil spin mode. Not freaking. Or heck, in here I could do jump, air kick. Okay, don't jump, air kick. 
Yeah, I know what how to use the freaking. I hate this. No. I can't hit it, dang it. This holy water. I'd about to say, not more holy water, no. Holy water's that one thing that you never use in Devil May Cry 3 and 1. I don't know about 2. Nobody plays 2, so 2 doesn't matter. But, it's one thing you never use, because by the time you actually got enough for it not to be a rare resource for you to use, you're already good enough at the game that you didn't need to use it. <laughs> at least that's how it is for me, I don't know. If it wasn't like that for you, then you're bad at the game. Oh, frick. Wait, no. No, um, duh, 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 nope, dump, duh, dump, nope. Wait, so, okay, so Grim Grip, that's, that's Grim Grip. So that's what I'm used to. That's what that okay. That makes that's what I'm used to. That's what I'm used to. There we go. No, why? Why right, did it put me into a combo? Come on. Oh, and you were you run so slowly. Pretty sure there's an ability I can get to level me up there, but. That's what I kind of hate about some old video games, is how slow the characters move around. So I think the only one that doesn't have this problem is on, like, uh, what's it called? Metal Gear. Yeah, Metal Gear, you have the ninja run, which is how you can kind of just go around fast. Wait, can I, can I, like, can I, like, mess up that con- No, I can't. Darn it. I wanted to, like, battle. I want to go battle. Ooh, a secret mission. Can I cancel this? I did it! What is this fighting space? Oh my, come on. Seriously, come on.
Or they're really gonna give me a really short fight and then another fight immediately after. Ooh, this is water. Wait. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Unreal Engine, no underwater physics. Only above water physics. Okay, this doesn't. This, I don't believe this game uses Unreal Engine, but Unreal Engine recently, if you didn't know, came up with. Well, it was able to create water physics were under the water also moved instead of just above the water. I believe it, it's going to be used in GTA 6. So that's something to look forward to. And this looks like the old games. And the new game-ish. Why is there a single red orb there? Oh, I, I can skip that fight. Oh, wait, no, I can't. Oh, come on. That path is definitely leading backwards. Can I jump down this? I can. And walk back here and then fight again. I can. Deadly. Oh, is that a Venom reference? This thing's just full of Venom references, isn't it? This totally is not before Venom came out in movies. Well, I mean... It could be the comics. Could it? Yep, nope. They, they, they referred to the comics of Venom. And whatever low CGI movies there could have been back there. And I don't know. Can I get in here? I can. There we go. Oh, wait. This looked like Devil May Cry 2. Why does this look like Devil May Cry 2? Yes, I played it. It sucked. I couldn't get past the first level because nothing happened. Oh, this is like... Oh, they, this, these ships are in Devil, are in um, Devil, DMC Pock, Pico Combat. And yes, I got into Pico Combat early. Here's my proof. The creation of this video is December. The day is December 19th. I have been playing Devil May Cry Pico Combat for the last two months. I got into the game early, and it is fun. I love that game. I play it all the time. They actually just added, like a week or two ago, Nero Devilbringer to the game. There's like multiple versions of each character. Multiple Dantes, Neros, Ladies. Right now they just have Dante, Nero, and Lady. And Virgil. There's a few versions of Virgil as well. But they're adding V, and I was like, no, you should add Trish. Because Trish is hot, Trish is powerful, and Trish is sexy. You should add her and not V. Nobody likes V. I don't... At least I don't like V. Wait, can I like... Rick. Not what I was trying to do. Oh, that distance is terrible. Yeah, I don't like V. I never. I, the only time I use V is when I have to for the mission. Like when I'm trying to rank up. Ooh, blue. Oh, these are back. These aren't in Devil May Cry 5. That's what's funny. Oh, whoops, that was confusing. Rift. Hey, <laughs> get I cut a rift in it. Using both versions at the same time. A rift is a split between etherical dimensions. Not specifically dimensional planes, but dimensions of existence. That was a 2D dimension of existence I could have rift in it, therefore exposing it to the base dimension we live in. Dimensional math, huh? I just went further, but I don't feel like giving my viewers a headache. I love the two bullet thing, it is so smart to explain. So the first bullet fired is a pierce is an explosion round. Like the bullets fire it's interesting them. But the first one, the top barrel so if you see, there's like, you can kind of see two holes. The first bullet fires slightly, like, m not even milliseconds. Less than milliseconds before the other one. Hits the demon, explodes the armor. The second bullet gets into the demon now. Because the armor is exploded, you can get in now. Gets into the demon. It's like, that's why it does, that's why it actually works. The second bullet gets inside the demon and does the actual damage. So you got the armor break and other things. 
Also, why are the demons different in every single game? Actually, these are kind of similar. These ones are kind of similar to the ones in... Because there's similarities. Like, there's uh, the riot demons. Not riots. Uh, oh, no. Riots. Yeah, they are riots. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're riots. Um, they have... There's something that acts like them in Don't May Cry 1. And then these things... Then those things look like the things from Devil May Cry 1 as well, the ones that you normally fight. I think I go this way. I think so as well. Oh, there's even like two different lights there. If you look closely, there's like two different lights that appear. Like two different ex tiny explosions coming out of the gun. I can't hold them, darn it. Well, I think that might be a yeah thing as well. Kind of wish the busters could be a little like different, maybe. I don't know. It's like instead of like every single time is just me picking the guy up and chucking him on the ground. I don't know. I this is the first time playing this game, so it might change later. Might not. I don't know. Oh, here we go. This is our skill. Also, that doesn't sound as powerful as devil as um. Uh, don't make our fives. Just that that just doesn't sound as powerful. Let's see, so what actually does damage? So you see the explosion? That is the armor breaking round. The actual damage goes inside whatever he's shooting. So obviously with weaker things like human metals and rock walls, they both just go inside. Because the explosion is specifically catered to um demons. Oh, holy, what is that? Oh, it has boobs. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's a lot of red orbs. 10,000. I would love that in a normal game, but these ones don't work on red orbs, so I'm mad. Can I, can I, can I mess with that? Oh, no. I can go to this. Oh, this is, like, so... Oh, this one actually looks good. It's like another game is just kind of there. This one looks good. Oh, wait, no. Hey, sorry. Okay. Oh, we still have 97 proud souls. How do I get... Okay, what do I buy? Can I buy? Okay, I think I buy these with red orbs. Yeah, I buy these with red orbs, okay. Can I, I cannot buy, mmm, slightly annoyed. I can't seem to buy, wait, can I like get these and level up my health? I can get more health, sweet. So I get more health using that. Oh, that's, oh, I love that. Oh, that's nice. I would still much rather have red orbs for all of it, but whatever. Whatever, I, I can't change anything now. This game is as old as freaking, I don't even know. This game's like 2008 old. I, don't, I know I'm older than it, but still. It's pretty sure like 1957. Yeah, yeah, I'm older than it, I'm pretty sure. I am kind of mad that I can't, like, wind up the power. I can't hold the button. Get more damage. That's, like, a whole thing in Devil May Cry 5 is that you can, like, hold the button down. And it does more damage. And if you, like, hold the button while also comboing, so they have a maxed out, like, ammunition stored. Oh darn it, it still falls. Let's see how slow he is. A 
atomic. Oh, is that a <laughs> World War Two reference? Here comes the sun. Do 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 do. I'm not racist. You are. Oh hell yeah, I'm racist. What? Oh god, no, I'm kidding. I don't even know where the game wants me to go. I'm just going places. Um, okay. Hear the battle music? That means. That's it for today's episode. Goodbye.